Okay, now it's time for uh, the question we ask every week. We ask this every episode because we want people outside of the area that are watching this to get to know Spokane. Where's your favorite place to grab a, a drink or some dinner in the kind of the inland Northwest? Uh, a favorite place of mine is in the summertime. Uh, I like to ride my Harley out to, uh, to Curly's over uh, State Line, Idaho. And that is a great place to grab a drink. Uh, they have great drink specials and a great place to dance. What are some of your favorite places to eat in Spokane? Uh, well, one of them is the Cascadia Public House uh, that's up off of Francis and uh, Ash. Uh, the food is, is incredible. I recommend it highly. The other place that I highly recommend is Tortilla Union. You and I have yeah, been there. Yeah. Um, I love it. I don't even know what else to say. Besides yeah. that, uh, their shrimp tacos are some of the best I've ever had. Uh, just absolutely delicious. Um, it's down in the, in the mall downtown. Um, if you ever get a chance to go, make sure you do it. Perfect. And what do you get at Cascadia Public House? Uh, they're Philly. Okay. Uh, the Philly was the best I've ever had. I'm not like a connoisseur of fine cheesesteaks or anything like that, but it was really good. And I recommend that you get it if you go there. Um, they're home menu, but I mean, besides, you know, everything on there is good. Good. Spokane is voted one of the top cities for foodies in the, oh, really? in the country. Yes, we are a big time foodie area. Um, for me, anything sushi. I love sushi. So uh, a little while back, we went to uh, Ginger up on the South Hill okay. uh, Asian Bistro and they do sushi there and it was great. It's a good place. They're right in uh, where we live. So we go there quite yeah, often. Love sure. that place. So I like Durkin's Liquor Bar in downtown. Um, they've got a basement, which is pretty cool. It's kind of dark and, and it takes you back to the old Prohibition era. Um, I like the whiskey and the burger with bacon. That's my favorite. Yeah, I actually just had that burger the other day. It's delicious. So I live up on the north side. So, um, and my mom actually lives right off of Monroe here and North Hill. Um, we went there for St. Patty's Day. They had a great St. Patty's Day going on, and we've been there before for dinner, and they do a good job. And yeah, it's really good food. Yeah. Our, yeah, good food and a you know, nice atmosphere, and they did a good job with the building. So. What is your favorite place to grab something to eat in Spokane or Coeur d'Alene for you, because you're kind of obviously a border dweller. Right, I am. So uh, my husband and I, we always like to visit restaurants that have kind of an eclectic menu. So um, a lot of times we'll head over to Craft It over in Coeur d'Alene, we'll go to Timber and Post Falls, and then we'll also visit, um, I've, recent, I've recently discovered my husband has not had the um, pleasure yet of trying Craft and Gather in Spokane Valley. Okay. And uh, they have this amazing bacon popcorn. Wow, that sounds that delicious. I have been trying to perfect it at home. My family's not unhappy that I'm making a lot of bacon so that I can get the bacon <laughs> grease to cook the popcorn in. Sounds good. Yeah, it's really, really good. I highly recommend it. Uh, we always ask, what's your favorite place to go uh, grab a meal or a snack in Spokane? Yeah, well, so I work at a cold old banker tomlitz in North Office, um, and I also live in the North End here. And so um, oftentimes when I'm meeting clients or, or colleagues or just frankly wanting to stop for a good place, I, I will go over to Petit Chat. It's a bakery. They do all their own in-house stuff, and they have just amazing quiches. So I go there for the quiche and stay for the coffee and there. try to avoid the pastries because they're killer. There you go. Yeah. Well, I live up in Mead, so I kind of uh, stay closer to home. Uh, but uh, McLean's Pizzeria is is amazing. They have great atmosphere, great service, great food. Um, so we like to we like to go there quite often just to hang out. Perfect. What do you what do you get when you're there? Uh, buffalo chicken cheese bread is amazing. That sounds um, delicious. Oh, it is. It is. So it's a really hard question because there are a lot of really good places to eat and drink, but um, my husband and I just went for Inlander Restaurant Week to The Wandering Table, and it's one of my favorite places in Spokane in Kendall Yards. They have this really fun thing you can do where you pay like a certain dollar amount for um, like a chef's choice meal, and they just bring out like mystery items that you get to try, and it's so good, and I had the best old fashioned ever there as well. So I love The Wandering Table. The old fashioned is also my drink of choice and I have not had one there, but I will soon. Perfect. We'll see you next week on Asking for a Friend.